Hey guys, in this lesson we are going to see how to create a simple shell script in macOS terminal. Firstly, you have to open your terminal and then navigate into a folder that where you want to create your shell script is. I won't go to my desktop and there is another folder, this one. I will indicate that with forward slash and then my and there is a space. We cannot put spaces instead we can define there as a space by using backslash and then space desktop now I will go to my folder coffee programmer because I am doing my computer apps there ok firstly we need to create the file using vim use vim command and then file name that you want to use for your shell script I will say first script like that now extension you have to use dot sh okay here what we are going to do is create a bash file for that firstly we have go to the insert mode press i in the keyboard otherwise you cannot type here then we have to define hash exclamation mark forward slash bin forward slash bash we are doing this because operating system can understand this is a bash script all right now we can go to next line here let's print something to print something we can say echo double quotations inside double quotations we can say our message let's say hello world and then exclamation mark all right now we have to exit from insert mode press escape button in the keyboard to get out from the insert mode okay and then what we have to do is save this shell script to save that you can say colon and then wq exclamation mark then press enter all right now you can go ahead and say ls hyphen la and this will return all of the files including hidden files here there is the file that we created first script.sh and if you clearly see this it only have reading and writing permission it doesn't contain any executable permission so we have to give permission to this file that can be executed so that you can say hcmod in your keyboard and then what type of permission that we have to give you have to say 755 here and then file name which is first script.sh okay now how we can run this you cannot directly say like this first script.sh it will show a error like this but you have to say in the current path by saying dot forward slash and then executable file name dot sh now you can see hello world has been printed here okay that is it for this lesson and i'll see you in the next lesson thank you